All right, so I just pasted this code here from Materialize to get a card into our website. Um, so now we have this here and our website is here. Good, so we have this card. We have fried asparagus and then some description. And then we can make this order. Save and refresh. Cool. Okay. Uh, let's try another dessert. I mean appetizer. Loaded boneless wings. Let's get an image card this time. All right, so this indentation's a little off, so I have to fix it. So I highlight this, uh, and then I hit tab to highlight to move all of them at the same time. Notice that um, this already started a row, so if I copy this verbatim, it's going to create a new row. I actually want this card to be on the same row as the other card I just put in, so I'm just going to start here and end it here so that I don't start a new row. So start a new row here. Notice that this is S12 and this is S12, which is fine. Here though we have M6. Will that work with this M7? No, what do I gotta do? Change it to what? Six, good. At least six if you want halfway. Um, and then we gotta just fix it up. So this image obviously won't work. So we need some kind of appetizer. Oh wait, I meant to stay there and find a Chili's appetizer. So we use this image, paste that in there. Now we gotta find out what that is. It's that right there. Here we go. Southwestern egg rolls. Paste that in there, copy the description, and then Paste the description in there, and we'll do order. Save it and refresh. Oh man, it's coming out in a different row. All right, let's fix this. So we have fried asparagus on one side, and southwestern egg roll should be on the other side. So what is going on here? Oh, I know why, because I did it at the end of this row. So it's good to comment in your tag. So to leave a HTML comment, you just do less than exclamation dash dash, and then you can type end row so that you know where that row ends. And then what I'll do now is cut this since this should be, oh, I cut too much maybe. right here. Control X. Perfect. So this will be where uh, fried asparagus ends. And I'll paste this. And then I can comment here. Uh, Southwestern egg rolls end. Perfect. Uh, something's wrong with my indentation. 
So you can see this is where the column starts. So I have to fix these here. So I tab it. And now the indentation looks good. And refresh. And bam. Now it's on the same row. Uh, let's see what else we got. Any questions so far? OK. Last one I want to do is the card reveal. So I'll copy this. I'll throw this in. Wrong one. I'll put them next to each other. So now I'm going to change these to four so that I can have three cards in a row. This is where Southwestern Egg Rolls ends. I'll paste this in here. But I need to also set the columns. So I'm going to do this. Here. And this is where it ends. And let's find another appetizer. Okay, so this sa sampler looks good. Here we go, triple dipper. And they have it trademarked. Um, read more details. All right, so they have an unordered list here. Okay, cool. And let's check it out. So refresh. Um, okay. Um, so two things. So it looks fine. Uh, we have this word more vert here. And that's because it's using materialize um, font icons. But we need to activate those, because those by default are not activated. Um, so I can show you how to do that real quick. You go to icons, and you have to stick this as an extra style sheet. Copy that, and style sheets go on top. Put it right below the materialize, and right before your custom styles. Save that and then here refresh. There we go. And there's your reveal. I wonder what that link is for. Maybe this is for order. Um, so that is Order, and then I'll put this here so it doesn't do anything. 
save it and refresh. There we go. Order, which doesn't go anywhere yet, and then card reveal. Cool. Okay, so those are the different cards that you can use for uh, materialize. We have the basic one, we have the one with the image, and then we have the card reveal, where it shows more information. Any questions? Okay, awesome. So let's work on the same site that you were working on last class and add some cards. I will uh, put this on GitHub and share the video with you.